everyone. It is time for another design team, uh, Scrapping Wonders Design Team YouTube, and I'm going to continue working in my collage or rainbow collage journal. So, red, orange, and you can look back, and I've done all these. If you go into the Scrapping Wonders Design Team playlist, you'll find all of these. Yellow, green, blue, purple, black and white, basically, gold, silver, pink, brown, and now I've got a few pages left, so I'm just trying to figure out. I've got one, two, three, four, uh, four spreads left. I've got an idea, uh, they're kind of going to be neutrals, the rest of them, but I've got an idea for uh, two more besides this one. I've already got ideas. So I'm going to be doing, this is what I'm going to do. I don't even know what to call this color scheme, um, but they seem to go together. So it's just going to be neutral. That's what I'm going to call it neutral. I don't know what else to call it. <laughs> and I'm thinking I want to just like, I love, love, love this picture. And so I think I'm going to just put it on here and then I'm just going to trim the edges. Because sometimes that really actually works really well. So all you do is I just go and kind of just cover the whole area. Um, I probably have to go back and do like some parts like edging again. Um, that kind of happens when you're doing it this way. Um, but anyway, just try to get it lined up as best you can on one side and bring it. Um, obviously, I'm not getting the entire edge. That's not a problem. I just go back later and worry about that part later on. I'm not going to concern myself with it at this point. Okay, so I'm just trying to get it um, down really well. All right, then I'm going to take um, this one, and I think I'm going to, I think with this camo, I just want uh, this part of the camo, like right there, but then I can't, I'm not going to do that first. Let's go with this next. So I'm just going to just do this, oops, and I'm just going to put this in right there. Okay. Then I'm going to put um, this piece right there in the middle. So I'm just going to do the edges like this much and then I will come back and uh, firm down the pieces that need to be done a little different. Okay. So there Okay, so that leaves me this spot here for the camel. Like I said, I'm going to go back and fix some of these spots up. I'll trim them up. I'll, I'll re-glue where I need to re-glue. Um, we have this. Obviously, I think is super cool. Um, but I don't need the whole thing, so let's just do right here, and let's just do maybe this right up to here. Let's just do it here, and then I'm going to tear, okay? Okay, so there we have some pieces done, and before I add anything else and I'm not going to put this in so put that away so now is a good time to go and let's just do the trimming so 
So I'm going to just come right here and trim off the pieces. Um, I might use this piece just a little bit here. Um, I would like to find a different piece to fit in here rather than this one, but I'm just going to go ahead and put this piece in right here. Okay. All right, so then I'm going to come here and I'm just going to trim off that. And let's trim this. Okay. And we're going to come over here and we'll trim off this. I might use some of these pieces. Um, I haven't decided. We'll just see. So you just um, very simply you just trim off the excess. This is actually an easy way to do this collaging because and it doesn't work all the time but um, there's just some things I do where I feel like it's a good choice. Alright, okay. So let's take a look. It's kind of a green tone, right? I mean, I've got some stuff in here that's obviously not green toned, but it is kind of a green tone to it. And I have some pieces left that I want to see if I just like add them in, you know, as another piece. So let's try that, like right here, and let's do another one, and let's put that right here, and I do have more. So I'm going to put that right here. I'm kind of liking that because it just, it seems to add something to it. Okay. Now the only other thing I am going to do is some washi and I'm going to add uh, some phrases. If I can find if these are can go with the tone, like, and kind of the sentiment is what I'm looking for. So, um, let's see. I think I can, because I can do this, Daylight Dreams, so there, and then, uh, it's got to go with the color scheme. Every detail of their journey. And then I think just one more. Right here. Went off bravely. Okay, so that's all that I'm doing with that. And then I think really the only thing that this is missing, I'm going to do a little washi. And you can see this takes, like this is only taking me like 10 minutes to do this whole piece and it's going to be done. But I want to have the right color washi in here. Because I want to be careful not to add... Um, a color I don't want. So maybe a tiny bit that right there. Just these little keys. I'm just going to kind of put them in a couple of spots. I want to be 
careful how I do that. Just doing a couple things. We'll put one there, and then we just really need one more. Maybe, and nope, I don't want it there. I'm trying to be really careful about where, where I place it. Okay, so 10 minutes, and I have a kind of a neutral palette. It's a neutral, but it's got kind of a little tinge of a greenish, kind of a green, tiny bit of green in there. Um, I'm not sure, but uh, I like it. I hope you like it too. And thank you for watching, and I will see you next time with the next one. <laughs> All right. Bye.